Hello everyone, welcome back to my Minecraft Survive this year. And if you are wondering why I am out at night with these two guys and a diamond in my hand, the answer is really quickly for this achievement, diamond to you. So it says throw diamonds to another player, but this is a singular survival. But there's a simple way to fix it. You just throw it to a zombie. And as you can see in the top right part of my screen, I have earned the achievement. And now I must get my diamond back, which is the hard part now that I'm at half a heart. Okay, good. Now before I do anything else, I'm gonna go to bed, because I'm not gonna die. So yeah, I just really want to get that out of the way. So, if you ever need to know how to get that, all you have to do is just throw it at a zombie. So, yeah, I actually did not know that before. And now that I do, I was actually able to complete that. And the reason why I wanted to complete that is because, if anyone knows, me and Ultra Smash Gamer are actually going to have a contest to see who finishes all their achievements first. And I just really want to get that one out of the way. Because that one t probably takes the longest time if you don't know how to do anything. Like this. And don't mind that I blew up. Because, you know, me just blowing up is normal. I mean, I blew up over there. I blew up right next to my house. I blew up everywhere. Is that skeleton? Oh my god, he has an enchanted bow. To get my armor but don't ask why I'm just gonna, don't ask why I'm just wearing this these pieces of armor I'll just tell you instead I'm trying to waste all my armor and then make a whole new set oh my god that was so easy because like I just don't want to start adding to my set like I just feel like it's almost dead anyways. I might as well just get it over with and have it destroyed. Because I just don't want to waste any materials. Because this series will probably go on for a while. Since we're going to try and get every achievement. And I do not want to have to die. Because like, I can just see it now. My armor is full. Something destroys every last piece. And then, like, I keep making new armor just to fix it. And then, like, I just keep losing it. So, that I'm not going to do. And I should probably get rid of this food. It's not like I'm going to need this eating seed. Yep. I don't even know how much... Wait, look, look. I need to see how much food I have. So, yeah, this is totally normal. 13 baked potatoes, um, let's see, um, one raw salmon, um, two stacks plus 24 bread, seven rotten flesh, two potatoes, you know, perfectly normal, perfectly normal having over two stacks of bread. <laughs> Seriously, I did a lot of farming off camera. So, you know what? Wait a minute. Nope, I don't have a pickaxe. So, I'm actually... Wait a minute. What happened to my pickaxe, anyway? Because I remember there was a pickaxe over here. Like, I know I had a pickaxe when the episode started. And then I died over here. Okay, there it is. I was wondering, like... Okay, so I believe I have everything. And I guess the, the boots actually did look like it. I'm actually going to save these, though. I mean, those boots are actually pretty good. I mean, just look at it. Protection 2, Feather Falling 2, and I'm Breaking 2. I mean, if I act... I mean, hopefully I can get better enchantments on other things and then combine them. So... As everyone knows, there is nothing currently down here. And this episode, you know what? I'm actually going to try and fix that. I'm at least gonna try and make a few bookshelves. So let's see. Do I have any more? No, 
I do not. And I do not have much sugar cane eye, but I have tons of wood. So you know what? What does this mean? D4. So I'm just seeing something really quickly. So I'm gonna need 12 books. You know what? That's gonna be my goal this episode. Start my enchanting room. So I'm actually gonna wait for this sugar cane to grow and just go on an adventure and start looking for cows and stuff. I am definitely going to need to start my enchanting room soon. Because I do not want to have nothing in my enchanting room when it starts. Because that's just like, I have to take time off camera. And I just don't want to do that. I'd rather get it done on camera. Because I believe I said this in the beginning of the series. I am not going to want to spend a lot of time off camera. I'm just going to want to try spending like maybe doing a few things off camera and I do remember last episode there were some cows over near my other house if anyone saw that so I'm actually gonna go over there right now I am so you know what I'm just gonna quickly show my house again I mean there's not much there but I did put some stuff in there just hopefully there's cows over here. This is a complete waste of time. Cause I just don't want to walk over here. Oh, okay, good. There's cows. Like, like I would just feel so upset. Like, no cows here after I walk all the way over here looking for cows. Like, my main goal is to find cows, and I don't want to not find any. Cool cow tipper. Give me your flesh. Okay, Mr. Cow. You'll go to good use in a bookcase. I'll make sure to read your books every day. Not really. I don't think I would have time. So I'm actually just going to look over here. If there's more cows, I'm going to look at my house. Um, apparently not. You know what? I'm just going to look at it anyways. Because I may have not spent a lot of time on it. But I at least want to see it again since I'm over here. Plus, I, well, since it's high on the mountain, I actually might see more cows. You never know. Or there might just be cows here. That'd be weird. Or cow in my house. That would just be plain creepy. Like, like, milk. I walk in and I hear a milk. Like, like, that just sounds weird. Like, like, I'm walking into my own house and I hear a creepy little milk. Let's see any cows. I do not see any cows. So I'm just gonna go back to my house. I hope that some sugar cane is grown. Well, actually, you know, I'm gonna go around this way. Seems like a better idea. Cause since it's a river, I might find sugar cane. Hopefully, I find sugar cane. I feel like I'm I'm like begging that I find sugar cane. Like, I need sugar cane in order to make these books. Like, I literally can't do anything without sugar cane. No, I'm gonna ask my money this. Have you seen sugar cane around here? No? Please so get. Don't why. Don't ask why I was talking to a sheep. Just seems normal, like he is a native. And he did deserve that punch for not having any sugar cane. I know it seems cruel. But it was for vengeance that he didn't have any sugar cane. Punch for some sugar cane. No sugar cane? He gets a punch. If he can't if I get sugar cane, he gets a hug. It's like the law. It's a law that I was told. Right once I started this game, by all the chickens that were next to me. They were like, remember, if there's something you need, then if we if it's near us, you give us hugs. If it's not, you can kill us, or at least punch us. 
my god, is there seriously a mushroom in the tree? Wow. Don't ask how I heard those voices. I just did. So, hopefully there are at least one more cow nearby. I will need cows. You know what? I'm gonna go to my village. I'm running around this way because I thought I saw a cow. My god. I hate when my eyes deceive me. Like, I just think I see a cow and then bam, I walk over there, no cow. So, I'm actually gonna see if anything's killed the villagers yet. Chances are something has because it's hard mode. I mean, look. You know, I want the best challenge. For the first day, I wasn't really thinking about that. Because, I mean, it is the first day. You might as well have it on something, like, easy. But the Ender Dragon and Weather are definitely going to be more difficult. Like, usually someone would do normal, but I'm just going to do hard. I want a challenge. They will perish in a hard mode. Which makes me feel like I'm going to perish many times. So what time is it? Okay, this was a bad idea. Probably should have slept. Oh well. Villagers, can I stay the night? I'm too young to die. I like these piggies. They live the nice life. Oh yeah, cow. So it was worth coming over here. Sally, it wasn't worth what time it was. So you know what? I'm just gonna quickly slaughter these cows. Any other cows I'm not gonna slaughter, just just that one. Unless there's like one nearby. I feel like there's gonna be like Okay, good, there's not twenty over the mountain. I feel like it's just gonna be like whenever I'm looking for something, I need to kill something in like a few seconds. And I need a lot of what it drops. Like like then I just kill one, bam, then there's a million that I see. You know what? This was the worst house I could have picked. Nine layer. Oh my god, this guy is. This guy's the best mother trader, but not the best at anything else. Stay back. If I shouldn't have had this on hard mode, they wouldn't have been able to bust down these doors. Oh my god, is that permanent? Oh my god. Um, dude, you better get out of here before anything comes. It's probably coming from right now. Or me. It's okay, it's coming for me. You know what? I'm gonna try and get a music disc. Okay, this is gonna be a... This is gonna need a lot of strategy. A few pork chops. And definitely be safety. Well, that definitely had safety in it. Safety for the creepers. I just wish I got the music disc if they had one. You've got to be kidding me. Five skeletons. Come on. Why can't life be easy in hard mode? Seriously, why do they have to spawn like that? I just feel like I saw a spider there. I okay, there's none there. That's good. This is the stupidest thing I could have done. Oh my god! Should I peaceful this? I think I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm not losing my stuff. I mean, I don't have the materials for it. And I know that this is a cheap move, but if I'm going to get my stuff back, I probably should go now. I probably should go in, like, in peaceful. Like, I don't want to lose my stuff. I mean, those boots I had were really good. I mean, like, say I'm going to fight the Guardians underwater to get their boot for a golden apple for, like, the Ender Dragon battle or the Wither battle. I'm gonna definitely need, like, boots like that. I mean, 
protection to what I'm breaking. That's pretty good. I mean, you can't go wrong with protection and breaking. It's just being the same thing. I'm just really hoping it doesn't despawn. Because, like, whenever you lose your stuff, it's always like, I'm not going to make it in time. Like, it's always like that one little moment where, am I going to make it in time? Am I too late? Like, anyone who ever, like, I'm pretty sure anyone who's actually ever had this situation knows what I'm, like, knows what I'm talking about. Like, like, am I going to get there? Am I going to get what I need? And then, like, when you get there on time, you're like, phew, I didn't run. I didn't lose my stuff. And then when time does run out, you're like, no, it should have been me. So, yeah. Die, spider. Oh my god, is it seriously only spiders in the area? What the Enderman? Going for an Ender Pearl. Oh my god, seriously. What are the odds that I'm gonna run into a creeper and no skeleton? I guess very high in my chances. I don't know why I turned this on to hard mode. You know what? I don't even know why I came after these guys. Okay, I got the Enderman down. He got me down like five hearts. Okay, did he drop any Ender Pearls? No? Okay, I'm not sad. Okay, hopefully for an Ender Pearl or two. So they couldn't ask for 20 million. That would be, that would be physically impossible. What's that? Oh, you know what? And then, right now I'm imagining if there was looping infinity, like, all you'd have to do is kill the weather once, and the ender dragon once, and you'd be rich beyond your wildest dreams. Like, like, I, like, you just want to get a bunch of ender pearls or blaze rods or something, or gas tears, because gas tears are always important, and then, like, by the time you get it, you can't. Because then it's like a super rare drop because of gunpowder. Oh my god, Treoris! Stay back from Treoris, you hear? No one's hurting Treoris. Use my ride home. Oh my god. Worst idea ever! So, again, it's going on peaceful because there's no way I'm getting past all those creepers. Why must you do me like that? Why, Mr. Enderman? I thought we were friends. Sure, I hit you, but it was an accident. I wonder if you buy that. I'm coming, Mr. Enderman. You're not gonna see me coming. I'm gonna come for your flesh. Or at least one of your organs. I think that's what an Ender Pro would be. Like, one of their organs? Like, maybe it's mixed with an eye of Ender, but when you kill them, you just get the Ender Pearl. And the only way to get, like, the end, the eye of Ender part back is with, a, with like, blaze powder. Like, magical fairy dust. Wait a minute. I wonder if that is, I wonder if that's actually what happened. Like, like, they have two organs. One is an eye of Ender, the other is an Ender Pearl. And when you kill them, the Eye of Ender goes away. And the only way to revive it is with a... With Blaze Powder. So let's organize my inventory. Okay, is there any cows here? I'm just going to leave this um, peaceful for the rest of the episode. Because it's clearly taking forever. You know what, now? Turning it out to eat hot dog now. Because if it's turning today, I at least want to try and get a music desk. You gotta be kidding me! I just go over the hill, and that's what I see? Life is not fair anymore. Seriously. How is that fair, seeing like 20 mobs once I cross the hill? Seriously, that doesn't even make sense. Oh my god, am I gonna kill this creeper with the skeleton? Okay, maybe not. Oh my god, stay back. 
Can't hit me, bro. Can't hit me. See you, bitch. You know what? Forget it. Forget the music, sis. It's not worth it. Killing you is. Okay, that's good. He's dead. Bad news is, I probably am too. Now for you. Oh my god, I'm like terrified right now because I'm at half a heart. I knew that would happen! I'm just like eating my food and then like bam, sniped in the back of the head. I thought that might happen. Like, I saw the skeleton over there, and I'm like, please, no, don't snipe me. Don't snipe me, bro. And he's like, you know what? You don't want me to snipe you? Too bad. Headshot. It's not Call of Duty, man. There's no need for headshots. It's only need for neck shots. Snipe. I just feel like I heard a creeper. I'm just so nervous. I know it's not peaceful and it's just impossible for them to spawn up, but I'm just so nervous. Because I keep, like, dying. I think this is the most times I've died in one episode. If I ever write a book, you guys will come in it. At least your bodies are. You'll always be remembered by your sacks. I mean, seriously. You know what? I'm just gonna take some. I believe I already have some, but you know what, you can never go wrong. Never go wrong with killing squids. Yeah. Now onto the important things. I'm always just so nervous, like, I know the time is five limits for it to despawn, but I'm always, like, so nervous no matter what, because it's like, is something going to kill me and I take even longer, or am I just going to not make it in time like i know where it is luckily if i didn't that would be sad and you know what i'm not gonna be stupid from now on and not and i'm not gonna have those boots on i feel like i should just put them on when i'm about to die and like my and like my iron boots are gone like now because i can't find them oh my god can i seriously not find my iron boots mr skeleton did you you know what? I think I know what happened. I think he stole them. He stole my armor. Well, I saw his friend's bow. So, you know what? I'm just gonna go to my house and shoot one arrow out of it. Just like, you wanna do that, bro? You wanna do it? Get sniped. Even if I'm not sniping anything, I'm just gonna be me and use his last memory. And hopefully I find some cows on the way. Oh my god, literally all my tools are about to break. Someone stole my boots. Or they broke. I feel like someone stole them. Oh, and now my sword's about to go down. Okay, six uses left. At least that's a good amount. I don't know why I'm just checking this stuff. Just because I wanted to, like, know how much I have left to use it for, like, because you can never be sure when it gets down to the zone where you can't see anything, like, then it's just like, why don't I just do that? Because that's like, when will this thing run out? I need to get a new one so I don't die. Okay, good. I thought I, I, thought I lost my pork. I'm just looking at my beef, and I'm like, wait, did I pick up my pork? Did I pick it up? And I'm like, phew, I did. Can't go wrong with pork. See you time to get back to my house. Seriously, the sugar cane didn't even grow. Well, guess what, sugar cane? I hate you. I hate your family. And I hate your descendants. See, that's what I think of you. Seriously, don't not drop something. It's like mean. It's like. Orchard. Sorry about this thing popping up. I'm not able to get full of that. First dump my inventory on this just going. Let's see, do you want to wrap that out? Let's see, it's 
in. Eight seconds. Listen. Okay, here's my five dinosaurs. Right here. Okay, I do. Just gonna combine these. Get a bit more durability on them. This is what I think of those skeletons. Uh. But I think of them. They're jerks. So I just thought the remedies are their last known family member. So you put these away. I'm just like making room in my chest now by combining literally every last thing I have. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I hate this thing. It just keeps popping up. Sorry if it interrupts the video. I just can't control that. So you know what? You know what? I'm just gonna shrink down my chest as small as I can get everything inside it. And, and you know what? I'm gonna end this episode off with cooking up some nice young cows. I need it. I don't need your filthy chicken. Oh, seriously. So, you know what? I'm just gonna end the episode here. Thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.